a beautiful 1967 resto mod that has so many wonderful components. I've brought in help today. This is Jack Stanford. He is our general manager, lead buyer, uh, a little bit of everything. And I'm going to have him explain the underside of this car. It is pretty fascinating. Jack, tell us about the frame first. Uh, the frame is a SR3 chassis, and uh, it's been powder coated. And this particular SR3 is uh, loaded with C4 suspension. So that's out of a C4 Corvette. Um, it also has coilovers, uh, QA1s, which are adjustable, and ride height adjustable as well. Um, I believe it is a Dana 44 rear end, which is nice and strong, and uh, which is good because as you'll see in a minute, it's got a nice, powerful engine in it. Um, but everywhere you look on this car, you could just see the attention to detail in the build. All the cushion clamps that are threaded in, not just riveted, um, but the actual threaded into the frame. So if you did have to remove a line or something, you know, they can go right back in place. Uh, stainless steel lines, uh, stainless steel braided lines. So, I mean, you could tell there's no expense spared. Um, we've got C5 brakes, um, rotors and calipers there. Um, you know, just everywhere you look, it's nice quality parts. Uh, aluminum drive shaft. Um, if we move forward, this car actually has a electronic parking brake on it, uh, much similar to the C7 Corvette that uses an electronic parking brake. Um, the transmission is a T56 six speed, which again is a nice, reliable transmission. Um, those were used in Corvettes. In the Corvette application, they were in the rear of the car. This is with traditional setup, so this would be from, say, a Camaro or Firebird. Um, and then, of course, it's got the LS engine uh, with the supercharger on it. Um, we've got the side pipe hookups here, which are nice uh, mandrel bins. Uh, O2 sensors, and again, you know, you see all the stainless brake lines, and then, you know, the, the, just the clamps. Attention to detail, again, is, is top notch. Um, we've got the computer over here with a nice closeout panel that was handmade. Um, you know, and that's important because on the other side of these cars, everything is opened, correct? Correct. So it's nice, nice and protected. So the computer's in the same location as a C5 Corvette, you know, behind the passenger front wheel um, and as you come up here you know the suspension components are powder coated as well so you know they're not going to change colors fade anything like that it's going to stay looking nice for a long time um, same thing with the spindles they're powder coated the calipers are powder coated sway bars powder coated you see a theme developing here um, of course it's got the rack and pinion steering um, and then this air filter leads to that supercharger that sits on top of the engine. Um, but, you know, aluminum radiator, electric fan, um, just top, top-notch stuff here on this car. Thank you, Jack. Thank you Folks, sir. if you're looking for a show car, this is definitely the one. As always, with all of our cars, give me a call. 770-605-2056 or email john at buyavet.net. If you'd like to know more about this car, or any of our Corvettes we carry in stock. And as always, subscribe to our YouTube channel. That way you get to see the new inventory first. See you on the road.